Hey guys, it's Bellamy here from Midnight Suns and the Taylor Swift Eras tour movie just came out in Singapore this week and I just got back from seeing it. And yes, the movie is awesome. So this is just a quick movie review. And let me just start off by saying that this movie proves beyond a shadow of a doubt that Taylor Swift is an amazing storyteller. Like, I would even argue that she's possibly the greatest storyteller in our current generation. Every single song that she performs in this concert film is a story in and of itself. And there's just nobody in the music industry who's doing it on her level. More than just crafting great melodies and hooks for her music, I think it is the words that she chooses, her songwriting, that really sets her apart from everyone else in the industry. Every single word that she puts in all of her songs is just so well thought out and filled with so much meaning. And when you watch this live concert film, the way she expresses certain lines in her music, the way she sings certain words with different expressions, with different tones, and her facial expressions especially, every single thing really just creates new meaning to her music. And it's something that you will not get if you just listen to her studio recorded albums. All that emotion that she conveys in her live performance is only something that you will see in, well, her live performance. Or a recording of her live performance, and a very great recording in this case. She's so great in storytelling in both her music and her live performances that I'm convinced if she wasn't a musician, she would be a great filmmaker. Like, she would probably be one of the best scriptwriters or film directors in the current generation if she decided to be a filmmaker. So I think in the future, if she ever takes a break from creating music, I think she has a bright future in Hollywood. And especially after seeing this movie, I have no doubt about that. As for this movie itself, the audio mix is incredible. So make sure you watch this in a cinema with great audio. The set designs are so amazing. All the sets they constructed for this era's tour is just jaw-droppingly awesome. The dance choreography is perfect. And the camera work, when it came to filming this documentary, the camera work is amazing. So yeah, this movie is both amazing in both the audio and visual departments. So you know what, actually if you have the opportunity to catch this in IMAX, I would highly recommend it because that way you are guaranteed a great audio and visual experience. And the movie is almost 3 hours long, but rest assured, the movie does not feel draggy at all. In fact, you know, when you watch the movie, it's just hit after hit, banger after banger, there's no moment of downness at all. I honestly can't remember the last time I watched a movie that was this long and it felt so short. Like the three hours just flew by so quickly, it was incredible. And yeah, overall I've seen quite a few concert films and I've watched all of Taylor Swift's concert films and I would say this is by far the best Taylor Swift concert film and also the best concert film of all time, to me. I am definitely gonna buy the 4K Blu-ray when it comes out, so yeah, I'm looking forward to rewatching this movie many times in the future. And it is for those reasons that I'm giving this Eras Tour concert movie a perfect 10 out of 10. I know a lot of people will say there's no such thing as a perfect movie, but I think if you're looking for a concert movie, which is what this is, it's perfect. This movie has already made film history with its unique cinema distribution process. And if you have no idea what I'm talking about, I actually made a whole video about that on this channel. Do check it out if you're interested. And as well, I'm sure when the dust has settled, this will go down in history as one of the best concert films of all time. Anyway, that's all for this review guys. If you love Taylor Swift's music, or if you are a super huge Swifty like me, then you must catch this movie, especially in cinemas right now. It's definitely worth the 1989. Anyway, thanks again for watching this review everybody, and as always, stay gold. I'll see you all around.